So even if they are not drugged during, it's if and when they survive that situation, the, the turmoil and the trauma that they have to internally cope with, like there's no like there's no amount of conversations that you can have comfortably about that shit. And it's like sometimes the only way that they can cope is by trying to escape reality. Right. And, and that's correct. And with my current situation with my significant other, it's, I've, I've seen what it can do and I'm, I'm, I'm her safe space. I'm, I'm helping her regain her voice. But as I said, it, it's a lifetime effect and it causes a whole bunch of reactions because at a young age, she also turned to drinking Mm -hmm. to try to numb the pain. And that also caused more issues down the road, led to more, uh, an addiction to being uh, promiscuous. And addict, like they said, addictions, it's not just alcohol, drugs, it's other things. Yep. And sometimes it's the way that the victims find a way to cope with reality. 